Hello everyone, my name is Joe from XJBR and again I'm joined by Jordan. It's over there. J Chanman55 in the house right here. You're welcome. See that? I'm gonna walk it around. <laughs> Keep fucking walking. I'm gonna walk out there and let the water take me from that comment. So we are playing Rayco. Now this is one of the games that we have in the private rooms and since it is Spooktober and getting ever so close to Halloween, we thought it'd be fun to show you how to play this game since it involves the player in the VR and also the person using a phone. So we are going to start by joining the house. Okay, John, you got that? Okay, so what I want to show you first is how it all works uh, setting up. So let me just record my screen. Okay, so what you want to do first is you want to head to your web browser uh, and then you want to, on the search bar, type in lb.raycovr.com and it'll take you to this screen. Now, pretty simple. It says code and name. The code you want to put in is on the screen of the game with the person with the headset. So for me, it is X B L T. And then I want to put a name down. So what I'll do is I'll just put my, so I, I play this with some customers as well. I normally just use the, uh, I just put Lou and I press play. See, I, I always put Boo, why have we got Boo twice? Oh. Because traps fly okay. every turn. Uh, <laughs> you don't have much time. <laughs> you can escape. I know what we're doing. It's, uh, it's because it's it's logged me out. So let me try that again. <laughs> XBLT. Oh, I could do it with BLT, I'm not going to lie. What about the X? Which one? I'll just put JC this time, just in case. Hey, so I've got Boo go. Boo and JC. <laughs> I got, oh. I got Boo over here and Boo over there. <laughs> so I'm in the screen now. You can see straight up, you've got the first floor and the second floor. You can set a trap first hand on the dolls. So do you want to explain the aim of the game on this one first? No. Yeah. So the aim of the game on this one is I need to go around and find a doll. Each doll has a key. Now only one of the dolls has a real key. And within the house, is a demon, or well, this woman who had an accident years ago. And I have to avoid her. She's blind, but she can hear very well. So I actually have to throw items to, uh, to like distract her. Jordan's job is to get that woman to catch me by slamming doors or flickering lights or something like that. So uh, we'll, we'll show you that in the game. So yeah. I'm just going to show you there are. She's on my screen. Then. There, there is uh, traps on the each floor and each room so you can only set the one trap to begin with up until they uh play the game so first on i'm gonna put this one and that's set for that specific doll right there so whenever joe starts to play the game so whenever you're ready it will come up with a different menu i want to do this anyway <laughs> <laughs> okay, so as you can see, uh, I've got a different window coming up. There's a scare power on each one, so you can see flicker, uh, slam, and whoosh. So you can see the little blue bar above that slowly going up on my screen. It's already reached the first threshold, which allows me to do the flicker scare. Uh, it's about to cross the second one. Yep, that's ready now. So that's the slam scare. And then when it reaches the very end, Heavy. You've got the whoosh, which Heavy. is probably Dolls the best everywhere. one. Okay, so I'm about to approach one of these dolls. Use the use the touchpad to actually start moving as well and trigger to activate the doll. Hmm. And I'll activate the woman. Yeah. So it says there, fake doll.
stab you in the eyes. You want the carrot? Go get the carrot. Tea? Do you want tea? Let's go get the tea. as well, because the longer I'm in there. Jesus. That's not very helpful. Throw a lettuce. No, lettuce. Nice lettuce. Go get lettuce. Mm -hmm. She, she's following my footsteps as well, which isn't great. <laughs> oh, she was coming for you then. Please go out, please. No! I've got no... Oh, more lettuce, more lettuce. Oh my god. Woman, lettuce. Go fetch lettuce. Gonna go on for a while. Two thousand years later. Stay over there. I'm out. Teleporting, you son of a... You're just bringing it closer. I know. I tried to throw it over the pants. I don't know what this is, but I'll hit her with it if I need to. I can hear the doll as well saying over here. This is not good. There is no doll in here. This is not good. <laughs> the f was that? Oh, oh you fuck. <laughs> that actually scares me. <laughs> I think this is where the mural is at the end, I think. Is that a mural? Yeah, once you find it, you have to find the mural in this game. I'm trying to find you, woman. I'm going downstairs, I'm going downstairs, mate. You want, you want, you want, you want, mate. Later. <laughs> See you later, bitch. I'm going downstairs to make some tea. 
So she can go through doors as well. Yeah. That's good enough. I like that game. I think a door slammed and door slam made oh. her come towards you. And you was on the other side about to open the door. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good, thanks. <laughs> right. Well, we didn't really get to show you the ending, unfortunately. And I'm not doing that again. <laughs> uh, but if you do want other staff to have a go at this game and see if they can complete it, uh, let us know and we will check someone else on it because I'm not doing that. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I hope you did enjoy this video. There is, uh, we're going to try and record some more Spooktober videos. And yeah, I hope you have a brilliant Halloween. Bye, guys. See ya. Oh, that probably got me though. That really got me. <laughs>